Boulder County cracks down on large groups of college students in an attempt to stop a surge in coronavirus cases. Good evening. Thanks for being with us. I'm Karen Lee. I'm Jim Benham. And not just Boulder, Denver is also putting in place a new health order. But we start in Boulder County. This chart showing us how many new cases have been seen there since mid August. And students at CU make up the majority of people who have been getting sick. Our Rick Salinger has been covering the outbreak since the students returned to campus. And Rick, clearly it has not gone well. Well, Jim, in this time of more and more regulations, let's try to be clear about this. The new regulation comes from the Boulder County Health Department, but it applies only to 18 to 22 year olds within the city of Boulder, which of course includes the University of Colorado and just about everything around it. On the University of Colorado campus, students are learning a new lesson. If you party, you are going to pay a price. It's a personal choice. It's a dumb one, but you know, people put themselves where they want to be and will result in them getting sent home. Not them, but many other students were caught on camera disobeying social distancing and mask guidelines. Miles Levin took these pictures in August and is now upset to find more restrictions so late. I'm honestly frustrated and disappointed that these these officials uh, couldn't have seen the writing on the wall. In-person learning has been suspended. No gatherings allowed except for essential purposes. Students have heard from the university chancellor that they will not be sent home now. With this firm restriction on gatherings for all 18 to 22 year olds in Boulder, we, fo we are focusing on the virtual events that we can create for students and any other support that they may need while they experience college life in such an altered way. And 36 properties have been placed on two-week quarantines after people were found violating the rules to keep the virus from spreading. CU students flunking what could be their most important test. That grade won't be reflected on their average, but may be reflected on their health their families, the elderly, and others. Live in Boulder, Rick Salinger, covering Colorado First. Rick, thank you. Denver